Hey, Tori, I... What the? When I was asked to come by the GM's office, you were just about the last person I expected to see here. Don't tell me you're the new general manager of SmackDown, coach. No, no, no. The coach isn't your new general manager yet. But I have been asked to move over from Raw to take care of a few things during Teddy Long's absence. the same crowd I'm hearing? You know, I've accomplished a great many things in my career. I made a fortune in the stock market. I am one of the greatest WWE champions in history. And damned if I ain't one of the most humble sons of bitches to ever set foot in a SmackDown ring. It's all true, Cole. He is humble. You know what? You should try and be a little humble sometimes. Oh, please. But for all of my accomplishments, one of my absolute greatest was adding Tory Wilson to my administration. And nothing against you, Orlando, but you're my favorite acquisition. Bragging you do, it looks to me like you couldn't get yourself a mamacita without buying her contract. That's a damn lie. Women everywhere fall at my feet. I am a wealthy man. I am a captain of industry. I am a wrestling god. Well, if you're as great as you say you are, Holmes, then how about a little match tonight? You and me for Tory's contract. A match? With you? You've got to be kidding me. You're not in my league, son. What a champion. But I'll tell you what I will do. You go backstage and get one of your boyfriends to team up with you. And you can face my current administration in a match later on tonight. Generous of JBL. I mean, you gotta admit that, Cole. Generous? It looks to me as if JBL's ducking a direct challenge. Jordan has everything it takes to be a great competitor. Dude. Except good ju- Wow! Great reversal! How much longer are these superstars gonna be able to keep it up? Your guess is as good as mine, Taz. They're certainly not going easy on each other, that's for sure. Man, there's not an ounce of quit in these superstars. There certainly isn't. They're in this one to the bitter end. We've seen an excellent match so far, and it's not over yet. 
Not by a long shot, Cole. And that's a good thing. I don't think we could ever get sick of watching these superstars go at it. Me neither, partner. This guy might not have enough to kick out. It's been a... Man, his opponent looked like a punk with that counter. He's going for the pin! This could be it! If... What a submission maneuver! You must be familiar with this one, Taz! Yeah, I've been on both sides of it, Cole. That's the truth. And let me tell you, it's better to give than receive. There's the cover. Can he do it? I don't think the fans like that one too much. And I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE. And he doesn't give a damn what they think. There's the submission hold. I've seen a lot of superstars tap out to this one, Cole. You and me both, partner. And we might be about to see another one right here. He wasted no time going for that pin. Orlando's got some real impressive physical gifts, Cole. He's, he's going for the submission. And he might get it. He's got that hole locked in. Watch it. He reversed it. Looks like they might be taking this match down a notch here, Cole. The pace of the match may have slowed, but the intensity of these superstars certainly has it. You can say that again. Waiting for your opponent to make a move or give an opening can be just as intense as putting them through a table. And whether or not you have that kind of patience often means the difference between winning and losing a match. You never know what to expect from these superstars, Cole. I mean, this could be over in 60s. Wow, look at that submission. I ain't never seen it executed better. Neither have I, partner. And this might be enough to get the tap out right here. I think John Cena has risen through the SmackDown ranks faster than any other superstar in recent memory. I can't remember the last time I saw a superstar Two. dominate the way Cena has. Yeah, Cole, but you said it yourself. Three. John Cena has shot up real quick. Looks Four. like someone's making it pretty clear that he's not feeling too threatened right One. about now. Well, this is a good way to find yourself in a bad situation. Two. He's wasting time instead of following up here. Three. You saw that one coming. Four. Thank you, Captain Obvious. I just think it's unfortunate whenever a superstar decides to cheat to win rather than compete fairly. And I think these superstars are going to keep it up until they've got literally nothing left to give. And that's the attitude you have to take to win. You know that your opponent isn't going to hold anything back, and you can't afford to either. I'd love to know where you're coming up with this stuff, Cole. Of course, it's sure not for personal experience. Three. I know that. Three. Four. You know, this Doug Basham's a real cerebral superstar, Cole. My people... And there's the counter, Cole. This capacity crowd is certainly getting its money's worth here tonight. And it's a good thing too, Cole. If they're not buying tickets, we're not getting paychecks. Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about selling tickets the next time we come back here. Not after a match like this. I 
I gotta tell you, I didn't expect these guys to go off on each other the way they have tonight. This has been brutal this match so far. Well, Taz, it's not ballet, you know. Oh, really, Cole? Gee, you're... Submission hold locked in. We may see a tap out right here. And even if you can't make your opponent tap out, this will take a lot of fight out of him. It's so great seeing these athletes compete here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other sooner or later. Oh my, there's the submission hold. He's in the driver's seat now. No doubt, Cole. If your opponent lets you lock that in, it usually means that they ain't got much left. Man, this match is so good. It's even worth sitting next to you to watch it, Cole. Yeah, thanks a lot, Taz. You know, you're not always my number one choice for a broadcast partner either. You know what, what? you should do, Girl Pants? You should team up with Jerry Lawler. And it could be the king and queen on commentary. Real funny, Taz. Three. You know, that would almost be worth not having to work with a joker Four. like you all the time. Come on, ref. That should have been a disqualification Five. right there. Shoulda, woulda, coulda, Cole. But it's not. It's not a disqualification. He's climbing the turnbuckle. Will this pay off? You can't let your opponent continue to work over the same area of your body. Not if you want to win it. Look at this, Cole. Look at this. Oh, my God. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. The match usually doesn't go much longer. Danny Basham's a real bull in the chat. On the mat, shoulders Four. down. This could be it. Oh no, the referee is down. What's going to happen now? Anything and everything, Cole. No ref needs to go rules. Did they get the tag? Yes. Ha <laughs> ha. Look at this, Cole. He don't look too worried about this match. Well, he should be. Until that bell rings, this is still anyone's match. He slipped out of that one. Oh my god, I think the referee's out, Taz. I'll tell you, they gotta start getting sturdy at refs, Cole. This kind of thing seems to happen all the time. They made the tag, and here we go. What a counter that was. Man, you talk about superstars who ain't got an ounce of quit in them, huh? You're looking One. at them right here. And that's a potentially dangerous mindset to be Two. in. If you're too proud to realize that you're in trouble, you might wind up risking One. your career for a single match. Look, Cole, this ain't ballet. Two. You gotta go in there every single match and be willing to do whatever Three. it takes. You'd know that if you actually stepped in between the ropes. Four. I don't have to have been in a match to realize that jeopardizing my future one. for the sake of one match is incredibly short-sighted. Cole, I swear, I'm going to replace you with someone who actually Three. knows what they're talking about. Maybe Carlito. He might be a little tough Four. to understand sometimes, but at least he knows what it's like to wrestle a match. I've been looking forward to this match all night long. I don't believe it. This is a damn buggy. It ain't exactly Queensberry rules, Cole. But I'm pretty sure we ain't Queensberry neither. JBL's gonna notice that I'm missing before too long. But I have some good news. 
I've convinced JBL to put my contract on the line at Vengeance. In a... in an Iron Man match. That's great! But there are two catches. The first is that I had to agree that it would be a lifetime contract. If JBL wins, I'm his for the rest of my career. Don't worry, Tori. That will never happen. What's the second catch? The superstar who wants to sign the match for vengeance has to beat Orlando Jordan in a match tonight. Beat Orlando? No problem. I could take him in my sleep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you mean you'll take on Orlando? Just what I said, dude. You got a problem with that? Yeah, I do have a problem with that. I can take Orlando myself, Holmes. Right on, that's cool. Tell you what, we'll solve your problem the way I used to solve all my problems back in the day. With a hardcore match. I don't believe it. These guys still can't get on the same page. Now they're going to have a match to decide who gets to take on JBL's chief of staff later tonight. Not just a match, Cole. A hardcore match. This don't look good for Tori. Following contest is a... This is completely off the hook, Cole. We were expecting a solid match from these superstars, but this is even better than I'd hoped. Look at these fans. They didn't like that one bit. Yeah, well, oh God. The ref's on Dream Street, Cole. Anything goes now. Unfortunately, you're right, Taz. There's no one to enforce the rules until the ref revives. And there's the counter, Cole. So, Cole, you got any predictions, uh, you know, who you think's gonna win this one? No way. I've seen you embarrass yourself with enough bad guesses that I'm not going to risk doing the same. You know, RVD calls himself the whole damn show, and that just gives you an idea, just a little sample, how big this guy's ego is. I think he should focus his energy on winning matches and titles instead of promoting himself all the time. If RVD's got a big ego, it's because he's earned it. As a former ECW superstar yourself, you should know what an impressive career he's led so far. Submission maneuver. You must be familiar with this one, Taz. Yeah, I've been on both sides of it, Cole. That's the truth. And let me tell you, it's better to give than receive. I don't think the fans like that one too much. <laughs> I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE. And he doesn't give a damn what they think. He dodged that bullet. I'll tell you, anyone who thinks this business is a piece of cake, they should get in the ring with these superstars. I don't think anyone would last too long against them. These are trained WWE professionals. Eddie Guerrero. Oh my God! That's not what the chair was meant to be used for. Kaz, in your entire career, have you ever seen a superstar as loved by the fans as Rob? There's a lot of things under the ring, and all of them hurt. Let me tell you, Cole, I spoke to these superstars before the match, and I ain't never seen competitors more fired up and ready to get it on. Judging from how this match has gone so far, Taz, I am... There's only one thing that a 2x4 wrapped in barbed wire is good for, and it's not gun.
the conditions are right for a finishing move. This is dumb. Why is he risking everything by going up there? I think that if one of these superstars succeeds, someone had better get that 2x4 away from him! Here it comes, look out! Oh man, many a superstar has fallen prey to that finishing maneuver! I've been locked in this hole before, and it hurts even worse than it looks. I can't even imagine the amount of pain that... That was an impressive win, Cole. I got a... Can you feel the heat? Here's your winner! Can you for a man who just beat Rob Van Dam in a hardcore match, he's looking pretty good. Yeah, but does he have enough left in the tank to take on Orlando Jordan tonight? He'll have to. And he'll have to win if he wants to go to Vengeance this Sunday and face JBL in that Iron Man match for Tory Wilson's lifetime contract. Nothing move but the money, yeah. Uh, I do what I want and to. the and opponent. I to say what I want to. You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Cole, I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the line in there. You gotta do whatever it takes to protect yourself and pick up the win. Kaz, you're talking about two different things. Going outside the rules in the name of self-defense is one thing, but cheating to steal a victory and enhance your own career is something completely different. Orlando Jordan has everything it takes to be a great competitor, except good judgment about who he considers to be his friends. Give it a rest, Cole, please. Just, just give it a rest. Orlando's done pretty well since he hooked up with Jabin. This could be free right here. These fans just can't get enough of Latino heat. Eddie Guerrero's got them in the palm of his hand. Yeah, and I don't know why he lies, he cheats, he steals, and he lost the WWE title to JBL. What's he got left? How about a love for the business, Taz? How about a commitment to putting on the best show possible for his fans? Eddie has never forgotten that they're the reason he's here, and he never takes them for granted. These superstars have been going hard all match. They sure have, and that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. No doubt, Cole. There ain't no way you're gonna win a match if you're out of gas two minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. I don't think anyone in this match is even considered that they might not walk out the winner. I'm sure they have it, Cole. That's the kind of attitude that gets you beat quicker than anything. As soon as you let the slightest doubt into your mind, you can forget about it. And that's something I don't think people realize. The mental conditioning of the WWE superstars is just as impressive as the physical conditioning. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Orlando's got some real impressive physical gifts, Cole. He's a big dude, he's quick as heck, and you know what? He's got friends in high places. But he's still so inexperienced, Tad. There's the cover! Can he do it? Look at this, Taz! This could be it! Good night, Irene! Nobody sticks around long after taking a finisher like that. I wonder if 
we're going to see anything this good on Raw next Monday, Cole. Come on, Taz. I think we both know the answer to that one. And there's the submission hole. What a deadly maneuver this is. I'm not kidding, Cole. He dodged that bullet. You just don't see action like this every day, Cole. You sure don't, Taz. And we've got the best seats in the house. No doubt, front and center. We couldn't be any closer to this match without being in it. <laughs> Whoa, that's your territory, partner, not mine. I'm perfectly happy staying right where I am. He's in trouble, Cole. I am telling you, his opponents really soften him up. And now one good submission move could end this match. Look at this! Could it be? You're damn right it is, Cole. And that's a heck of a finisher right there. There's the submission hold. I've seen a lot of superstars tap out to this one, Cole. You and me both, partner. And we might be about to see another one right here. Guerrero is one of my favorite superstars on the SmackDown roster. And Rope break. He's got him covered. One, two. Come on. That had to be three. This one could still go either way, Cole. It sure could. It's not over until the referee calls for the bell. You know, we've seen some pretty good back and forth action here, but you don't see too many matches end that way. No, you don't. And I think we'll see one superstar dominate the match before it's over. Oh man, here it comes. And that might be the end of the match right there. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. Man, I almost feel bad for JR and King, Paul. When's the last time you think they saw a match this good? I couldn't tell you, Taz. I don't know if they've ever had anything this good on Raw. Me neither. Because I guess that just makes sense. I mean, after all, SmackDown is the number one... Look at this, Cole! Look at this! Oh my god! There's a reason that's called a finishing move! The match usually doesn't go much longer! He may get the three count one, right here! Two! Oh man, I can't believe that wasn't three! What's happened to Eddie Guerrero, Cole? I mean, this guy used to be the WWE Champion, and now look at him. What are you talking about, Taz? Eddie continues to compete at a level most super... He smells blood in the water, Cole. He's going straight for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive moment in this match. I certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. No matter what one. call you make, you're going to get on the bad side of at least one superstar. One. And that's about the last place you want to be if you're not a superstar yourself. Two. Trust me, I know. Three. Four. Looks like they might be taking this match down Five. a notch here, Cole. The pace of the match may have slowed, but the intensity of these superstars certainly hasn't. You can say that again. Oh, look at that. He's pleading like a stuck pig. I can't tell if that's a cut or a broken nose, but either way, the referee might need... Here it comes. Look out. Oh, man. Many a superstar has fallen prey to that finishing maneuver. What a reversal. I love it. Talk about rubbing your opponent's face in it. 
Yes, but this might not be the smartest course of action. This match is far from over. And I think these superstars are going to keep it up until they've got literally nothing left to give. And that's the attitude you have. He's going for a high-risk maneuver. And man, did it pay off. What a huge frog play. On the mat, shoulders down. This could be it. It's not easy maintaining this type of intensity week after week after week, Cole. Trust me. I don't doubt it, Taz. The WWE superstars don't get an offseason. They compete every week until they're not physically capable of continuing. One. Ha-ha! <laughs> look at this, Cole. He don't look too worried about this match. Well, he should be. Until that bell rings, this is still anyone's match. Oh, man, this is just about the last hold you want to find yourself in. I can imagine. Just look at the pressure being applied here. He wasted no time going One, for that pin. Two, three. It sounds like the Chappelle. That's all she wrote, Cole. Can you feel the heat? Here's your winner. an Iron Man match for Tori Wilson's lifetime contract. You know, Taz, I don't think JBL ever expects you to actually have to wrestle this match. I think JBL probably expected Orlando Jordan to get the job done last Thursday, but the chief of staff didn't come through. And as you can see from the fact that Orlando ain't here tonight, I think he might not be the chief anymore. And just a reminder to all of our fans watching at home, Although JBL is the WWE Champion, his title is not on the line tonight. Yeah, but never mind that. Tory's lifetime contract is on the line. Not for nothing, I think I'd rather lose the title. These fans just can't get enough of Latino heat. Eddie Guerrero's got them in the palm of his hand. Yeah, and I don't know why he lies, he cheats, he steals, and he lost the WWE title to JBL. What's he got left? How about a love for the business, Taz? How about a commitment to putting on the best show possible for his fans? Eddie has never forgotten that they're the reason he's here, and he never takes them for granted. Man, this, I'll tell you what, man, this one's just turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I gotta admit, it kind of took me by surprise, Cole. And that don't happen too often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty good idea of what to expect, but not this time. I guess it just goes to show you, Cole, like they say, anything can happen here in the WWE. Great reversal! Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. Oh, come on, Cole. What a deadly submission hold this is. We might see a tap out right here. Won't surprise me one bit. The longer you stay in this, the more risk you have for serious injury. Rope break. Rope These break. superstars give everything they got when they're in a match like this. But a lot of people don't realize what they sacrifice behind the scenes also. No question. If you want to make it in the WWE, you've got to sacrifice just about everything for your career. It has to be as important to you as anything else in your life. So what you got to realize is to make it in the WWE, this is not a job. This is a lifestyle. 
That's why you see so much passion for what they do in the ring. And that's something you won't see anywhere else. With all due respect to every athlete and entertainer out there, no one right. gives as much of themselves to their fans as the WWE superstars. JBL has every advantage you could possibly ask for in his life. Money, talent, fame, and a neck. What a reversal! I like JBL's style, Cole. He sets a goal for himself, he tells you exactly what he's going to do, and he goes right out there and he does it. Yeah, JBL talks a great game, Taz, but when it comes time to put up or shut up, he relies on his cabin. He slipped out of that one. Eddie Guerrero is one of my favorite. He's been looking for that all match, Cole, and now he's taking advantage. Come on, partner. Taking advantage is a rather generous way to put it. He's cheating, plain and simple. I'll tell you, as long as these superstars have got anything left in the tank, they'll just keep going. They certainly don't look like they're going to give anything less than 100% here tonight. I wonder how JBL is going to try to cheat his way to victory here tonight, Taz. You're out of line, Cole, and you probably don't want to... That's the way you do it. Pick on an area and work it over. That's what we've seen here tonight, and it's paying off. I think we might be in for a finisher here, Cole. This is a big risk. Oh, man, here he comes. And that might be the end of the match right there. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. He's going for the cover, Cole. One. No trouble getting out of that one. Wow, great reversal. You look at any other sport in the world, and you won't find a single athlete that can compare with a WWE superstar. And there's a reason for that, Taz. There are no off-seasons here in the WWE. If you're a superstar, you're performing every week of the year. And we're not talking about just swinging a bat or kicking a ball, neither. WWE is the most physical competition you can be part of, hands down. Hey, the ref's got a tough job. I mean, trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. Well, it's easier to get some superstars to play by the rules than others. And you know what, Cole? If you're going to get on your high horse again and give us another lecture about playing fair, I swear to God, I'm going to throw up. Is it so wrong to ask a superstar to play by the rules, Taz? That doesn't seem to be so unreasonable to me. That's because you never competed in a match, Cole. If you did, you'd know that you got to do whatever it takes to win. And if that means bending the rules a bit, well then, that's just the way the cookie crumbles. He's got him covered! One, two... The referee's hand was coming down for a three count. What's happened to Eddie Guerrero, Cole? I mean, this guy used to be the WWE champion, and now look at him. What are you talking about, Taz? Eddie continues Why? to compete at a level most superstars can only dream of. The fact Why? that he's not wearing the WWE title on his way to... You feel like a real jerk yeah. when somebody counted you like that. Three. Four. These superstars have been going hard Five. all match. They sure have. And that's where the superb Six. conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. No doubt, Cole. There ain't no way you're going to win a match if you're out of gas. Two minutes. Real this break. guy might not have enough to kick out. That reversal might stop his opponent's momentum dead. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. That's the law of the jungle, Cole. And injured superstars like a wounded animal. 
It's survival of the fittest. And that also means that if you're not at 100%, you gotta be able to hide it from your opponent. You got that right, Cole. This business is as psychological as it is physical. He's going for the pin! One, this could be it! Two. Man, I can't tell you how impressed I am with what I've seen here tonight. And here we go with the submission hold. This could be a pivotal moment in this match. It sure could. There's a lot of pressure being applied in that hole, Cole. This could be three right here. One, two. Is that it? No, only a two count. Looks to me as this can go down in the books as an instant classic. I think just about every match has that potential task. This is the WWE after all. This one's gonna keep on going until someone... Oh man, this is just about the last hold you wanna find yourself in. I can imagine, just look at the pressure being applied here. I gotta tell you, Cole, I thought I had this thing figured out, but now I got no idea how this is gonna end up. Neither do I, Taz, and I think it's that unpredictability that makes it so exciting. No doubt, Cole. I've seen superstars get a huge... Submission hole locked in. We may see a tap out right here. And even if you can't make your opponent tap out, this will take a lot of fight out of him. This has been a real rocket bus of a match so far, Cole. It has indeed, but I think this crowd would like to see these superstars. Rope He's break. going for the submission, and he might get it. He's got that hole locked in. There's the reversal, Cole. Oh no, he's looking for a weapon. This could cause a serious injury. is down. What's going to happen now? Anything and everything, Cole. No ref means no rules. Oh, look at that. He's pleading like a stuck pig. I can't tell if that's a cut or a broken nose, but either way, the referee might need to stop this fight. The ref's not going to stop the match, Cole. It's just a little blood. Come on. Be a man, will you? One. Two. Why do they keep so many dangerous weapons under the ring? Those things Three. can cause serious injuries. Four. Five. Wow, now that one's not in the rule book. But you know what they say, Six. it's not a crime if you don't get caught. I don't believe it. How could Seven. the referee have missed that? Eight. I gotta say, Cole, when I first heard about this Ten. match, I wasn't sure what to think. But these superstars are blowing me away right here. One. Really? As soon as I heard about it, I expected a tremendous matchup. Two. And I haven't been disappointed. Well, I wouldn't say I'm not disappointed. Three. But I'll talk about getting stuck with you as a broadcast partner. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that later. Come on, ref. That should have been a disqualification right. right there. Shoulda, woulda, coulda, Cole, but it's not. It's not a disqualification. The conditions are right for a finishing move. This is one heck of a match so far. It sure is, Taz. What do you think the highlight has been so far? Well, that'll probably come a little bit later on in the match. You decide to shut your yap for a few seconds, and I can uh, enjoy it in peace. Well, excuse me for doing my job, partner. Sorry to have disturbed you. I think that if one of these superstars successful... Look at this! Could it be? You're damn right it is, Cole. And that's a heck of a finish.
finisher right there. That's not how the ring bell was intended to be used. There's the cover. One, Can he do it? Two, three. This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. No surprise there, Cole. The WWE fans ain't exactly known for keeping their opinions to themselves. If you ever wondered just how much punishment a human body could take, Boy. I think you're going to get an answer tonight. You might be right, Taz. It doesn't look like these superstars Boy. are going to go easy on each other. That's not what they're getting paid for, Cole. Two. And besides, they got too much pride to give less than 100% in there. Three. Four. These superstars are beating the living hell out of each other, and these fans are eating it up. It's what they came to see, Taz. And these superstars are making sure they don't go home One. disappointed. Two. Three. This could be a finishing move right here. Four. Five. I think I've got a pretty good idea who's going to win this match, Cole. I wouldn't be so sure, Taz. If there's one thing we've seen, it's that anything can happen here in the WWE. He's going up. And what... Go Look at this, Cole. Look at this. Oh, my God. There's a reason it's called a finishing move. The match usually doesn't go much longer. Watch it. He reversed it. There's the pin. Can one, his opponent kick two, it out? Three. Man, you just can't put anything over on these fans. You sure can't. They see everything, and they'll let you know about it. Man, there's a lot of blood, sweat, and tears shed in that ring over the years. And if these superstars have their way, there's going to be a lot more shed here tonight. One. Two. What a cowardly move. He can't Three. win fair and square, so he tries to screw his opponent out of the victory. Four. Hey, look, there's nothing wrong with him doing whatever it takes to win the match. If it was that bad, the ref would have DQ'd him, right? these superstars call I mean they're not even contemplating the fact that they might lose here tonight they've sacrificed so much to get here Taz I don't think they can allow that was an impressive win Cole I got a new he did it he won Tory's contract back from JBL Now that's a gal who's got no trouble showing her appreciation. He's a lucky dude, Paul. Tory's contract and a victory over the WWE Champion all in one night. And I don't think his night's over yet, if you know what I mean. No, Paul, I don't know what you mean. Why don't you spell it out for me? He's such a fool. Hey, Tori, I... What the? When I was asked to come by the GM's office, you were just about the last person I expected to see here. Don't tell me you're the new general manager of SmackDown, coach. No, no, no. 